Well, Sir Peter, at the Grand National Weights, we spoke to you on Racing Post TV and you tipped up Bala Briggs for the Grand National. Here at the uh, Breakfast with the Stars, what's your view on the derby? Well, I think the horse we saw this morning, uh, Paul Moi, I think he'll make his uh, presence felt. He's, he's a lovely looking horse. He wasn't asked to do very much, but uh, he been, I think he impressed in his demeanor and outlook. I think his trainers have quite obviously have been championed many, for many years, a perennial French champion. And Andre Fabre, and I think he knows what he's talking about. And he, he, he seems to have a good opinion of him, which is... Uh, great thing in his favor uh, but all, all the same I, I very much hope that uh, that he won't be too strong for Carlton House I, I, he's done absolutely everything I gather required of him he's been well educated on the race course by a very excellent ride by Ron Moore at York and he's in the great hands he's uh, he's been doing everything I think that Sir Michael has uh, expected of him or hoped he, hoped he could do. He's, uh, he's, I think he's bred to stay. But I suppose that could be a slight doubt, but he's got a half-brother. He's won over 15 furlongs. And uh, I, think he's, I think he's bred enough to, well enough to uh, achieve a, a, an absolutely marvellous goal and uh, become uh, the Queen's first... Derby winner and the Royal Colours, absolutely spectacular.